And in this video, we're going to unveil a goldmine of opportunities to find thousands of clients, whether you are a seasonal freelancer or a business owner. And guess what? You can find a client around your area or anywhere in the world. I'm going to walk you through step-by-step -step process using an incredibly powerful tool. We'll also explore how you can generate essential clients information like their email address, phone numbers, LinkedIn accounts, and many more. But first, Heads up. I'm not here because I'm a sponsored by this company. I'm generally excited how game changing this software is. And I want to share it with you, hoping it will make a difference in your journey. So without further ado, let's dive into it. When you wanted to find a company around your era, you probably went on Google and type restaurants near me. But that's not the most efficient way to do it. Let's head to clay.com and you can sign up for free 14 days account. There is no credit card required and you will have a thousand credits for free. In this example, I'm a designer or developer. I'm looking for a company in a hospitality sector. There are two ways to go about it. We can search with LinkedIn, which is in my opinion the better way, or we can do it by a Google search within the platform. Let me show you how. So let's create a new table and the new table will go to click on companies and now using Google Maps. In here, uh, we need to search by the area we're looking for. So in my case, it's going to be a London and I think let's do a Bond Street. Bond Street. And I will choose this one is fine. Um, let's do Oxford Street. That's better. So South Bridges, fine with me. We can also adjust the radius. So I'm looking for this area and in the search query, uh, we need to specify what we are searching. So in my case, it's going to be a restaurant. And number of results on um, 20 is fine. Okay. Oh, actually, let's change it to a coffee shop and not a restaurant. So fine. And now we click on a new blank table. And now we need to wait. It will go to Google search, type the query we are looking for. We have a number of residents 20 and find a businesses in that specific area. We can also fetch additional results and add a columns like phone number, titles. And this is pretty useful already because now we have phone numbers where we can call to the customer and offer them a business. We have also reviews. We have got a website. So if you are a designer, or a web developer, you can visit this website and if you can improve them, you can contact the local business. We also don't need these three columns, so let's delete them and delete these columns, which is great. And now, as you can see, we have got uh, 20 businesses. We have got a rating, their website, title and phone number, which is incredible. And it took just a few seconds. We can enrich the data again and once we go to recipes, it's basically a predefined rules uh, by the company that is kind of mostly used. We select the SMBS and now what we need to do is to add a business name. So we click on slash and now we just look at the title, which is the business name. We add it in there and now we have a business website, which we have as well. So we just add a business website and apply. So what it's going to do, it's going to enrich the data we have based on the title and the website. If you look at LinkedIn and then it will also use AI to check if the person is still working in the company. It will try to find their emails. It will also validate the email. So let's see if we can find something. It will only give us uh, 10 results at the moment. So as you can see, we generated only 10. Once we press another 10, it will generate another 10 for us, which is amazing. 
you can find as many businesses as you want. It can be hundreds, it can be thousands. It's only up to you. There is basically no limitation. Now, let me show you a better way how to actually find leads for your business. That's how I would do it if, and if I'm a freelancer and I'm looking for some work. So I will go to a new table, I will click at people, and here find people from LinkedIn. Let's press continue. And now we have companies and job titles. So I'm looking for a job title. And here we will write a restaurant owner. And a restaurant. Okay. And the location will be a London. Or uh, let's change it to, uh, let's put London and exclude city, states or country. Let's do, let's write United Kingdom. Uh, yes. So let's exclude country, which is going to be, sorry, so it's going to be Canada and USA because I'm not looking for these countries. And let's actually remove the United Kingdom. Let's just leave London. Preview people and literally in a few seconds we'll have 2,500 people we found on LinkedIn. That's And that's basically amazing. We've got their name, their name of the business. We have um, the title, LinkedIn account. And now we can just import this data to our table, which is 2,500 people. We can try to find their uh, contact information like email, telephone number, or also their website, which is amazing tool. So this tool will definitely save you some time uh, to find your potential clients. I hope I help you do this video and I will see you on the next tutorial.